Hello, um, my name is Olada from Firewood the Body Home. Uh, I'm about to show you a demonstration model of the contraption which I have built. Um, patented as an invention that hopefully will try and address bidet functions experienced in the bathroom. Now, what we've done is put in the possibilities of having a washing facility within the normal standard toilet seat. As such. Right now, what you have there is a mimic of the toilet. So, this will serve as our system, which is the water tank and your toilet seat. Underneath this is where my proposed contraption comes into play. Now, what you have is delivery arms that are serviced by channels which come from uh, a special box which would replace your normal system cover. So what you have in the toilet is just the toilet cover and then the tank. What you will now do is when, you, when this is built the proper way, you take away your toilet cover and this will be as universally made as possible to fit your standard toilets. I know there are different variations and sizes, but we would also integrate that in with in regards to the number of units and variations of um, toilet types that would come out. So what you would have is you take away the system cover and you put our own system cover on it. And that would house your uh, motherboard for the electronics. It would have an extractor fan. It would have a combination cartridge for extracting the noxious gases. All this would have channels integrated within the seat which you would see from the drawing because that would be attached as well to the link for this video. Um, and they will show exactly what the happy seat which is the name for now for this contraption. So you would have a reservoir that will service only the wet washing application. Uh, it might have the heated integrated functions it will also have the extractor fan, as I said, as well as, excuse me, as well as a combination charcoal, activated charcoal cartridge. So this would have the ability to absorb your flatulence, flatus, this is gas that you expel as you use the loop. That will be sucked up into this housing unit and it will be inside a chamber where you have activated charcoal cartridges. Now these in effect are the absorption uh, devices that would eliminate the, the, the foul smell. In effect, it would also have an air freshener gelatin. It would be like a jelly substance on top. So, as it's sucking the air and it's being absorbed, it will release the freshened air. And as that goes up, it will now mix with the, or it will now burn off the gelatin air freshener. And that would release back into the, into the toilet. Fresh in air, air fresh in air. Okay, let's we deviate it a little. Let's go back to the contraption. So this is it, and it's activated by your weight. So if we do a demonstration, what you have in effect is as you sit down, the springs go in, and that comes down. So I'll switch that over again so you get a feel. As you sit, the spring brings out your delivery arm. Now, the thing to note is the device is made up of your spring, an actuator, which is just um, another member which is attached to the spring, as well as your delivery arm. As your weight on this end pushes down, you're compressing the spring, thereby allowing very, very simple but patented technology. It's quite simple, basic, can go into anything. And that will allow for the delivery apps to come down. Now, for some of us, because I'm very particular about what I'm sitting on, if I know somebody has already used it before me, I need to, because I'm not looking at the seats, I can't see the arms until I sit down. When I sit down, the possibility of seeing how clean these arms are is next to zero. What we've done is, in the design, that arm houses above it another delivery arm and at the end here 
is where you would have your tapered piston, sort of like a, another delivery channel. So if I use my finger, bear with me, to explain. This is the delivery arm that's going to come down when your weight activates it. At the end of the arm, you have another shootout. Now that is what would determine the angle, the optimum angle for where your anus region is. So that would protrude from that delivery channel. Above this delivery channel, it will have its own cleansing uh, apparatus or tube, which would, in effect, when prompted by the adjourning remote access, would shoot the water. So as soon as you ask for the water to come out, it's cleaning the arm, but it's not obstructing your protruded delivery channel, which cleans you. So I hope that's clear.